Every Friday, we'd like to answer some of your emails. Uh, this week, we wanted you wanted to know about decaf coffee, contagious yawns, and why a can of pop tastes different than a bottle. Good question. Here's Heather Brown. Do you ever yawn and then someone else yawns too? Often. Yeah. I don't necessarily want to, it just kind of happens. Brittany from Minneapolis asks, why are yawns contagious? Well, the folks who study yawns don't know exactly why. It could be we yawn out of empathy. Uh, you mimic. It's subliminal. As we're talking to someone, we feel how they do. You have empathy. How, how I don't. We I don't. <laughs> I lack empathy. But it could also be that yawning helps get our brains to an optimal temperature, and yawns might heat up or cool down our brains to get them to the right spot. So, a product of having like a hot head? Yeah. <laughs> it makes me feel good. Rick from Hastings wants to know why does soda taste different in a bottle versus can? Well, taste expert at the U helped me out with this one. First, the different shaped cans mean there's a different amount of air above the pop. And the airflow, once you open up the can or the bottle, it affects the aroma. The aromas that you smell can affect how you taste something. Right, of course. There's also a psychological aspect to this. Advertising may make us assume the soda in a glass bottle is higher quality, so when you drink it, you might actually perceive it tastes better. So it's more of your experience of it. Yeah. And Vicki from Shoreview asks, how do they take the caffeine out of coffee? It's a process that happens at the farm where the coffee is grown. There are a few different methods, but here's how they do it at 5 Watt. The beans are steeped in the hot water, and then pretty much like everything comes out of the bean. The aroma, the flavor, the caffeine. All of that stuff comes out, and they're able to remove like just the caffeine itself. I think it's kind of like sifted out. And then they'll soak the beans back in the water that has the caffeine taken out of it and let that water get back into the beans. So all the good stuff yeah. gets back in there. Did you know that? <laughs> no idea. Heather Brown, <laughs> WCCO 4 News. Downtown Heather Brown. If you have a good question, email it by going to wcco.com links.